Remember, our rib cage game, um, we take one of our ribs and make woman, okay? We are the ruler of the herd. Don't let any woman try to rule you, any female at all. The chaos continues. Can you imagine a scammer that believes this? Listen as Edwin Vito Corleone, Tony Montana, and Mistress put this publisher's clearinghouse scammer through the paces. James Cooper will never be the same again. And I just tell him Tony Montana is the only one he can work with, okay? You got it. All right. Uh, Mr. Flores, I heard you came back now. Are you there, buddy? Talk to me. Mr. Flores, is he on the line? For Leone? For Leone, is he on the line? Hey, Mr. Mr. Flores, are you, are you on the line? Hello. All right, just now, Mr. Hello. Carleone, we already found out where you are. You are in Jamaica, Chelani. Okay? Now we found you. We totally got a trace of your phone. <laughs> I told you guys. Look. You guys were only letting us get a trace of your number. No, you guys are in total jeopardy, okay? I, don't know what you're I could about, promise hey, you that. I really don't know what you're talking about. Hey, hey, Mr. Flores, if you're on the line, remember my name, Tony Montana. Mr. Corleone told you to work with me. I'm the only customs officer, Mr. Flores. If you're listening, don't Please. don't listen. These people are imposters. They, remember, the other guy said he was Mr. Now, Corleone, but he you guys wasn't. listen. You Mr. guys Flores, listen. I'm going to only give you guys Please two options. Hang up the phone. I'm going to give you guys two options. Only listen to Tony listen. Montana. I am only going to give you guys two I options. Am Mr. We're going to make a raid in Jamaica. We are going to make a raid. Listen. We are going to make a raid in Jamaica, Chalani, in the next two months. You guys could turn yourself in right now, you, or you could go in the run. Are in Jamaica. We are We're coming exactly at Chalani, at B side. I'm a, I'm a customs officer in D.C. My name is Tony Montana, from, Mr. Floyd. You are from I'm holding you money. You, I'm holding you. I don't you even know from, if it's money. Are, I just know it's a package, and you need to pay the $15,000 if you want your package released, Mr. Flores. If you're on the line... You hear that? You have no experience got, from customs. You have no experience in the custom agency, so I stop am, acting like you're someone. I am a customs someone. officer in D.C., Mr. Flores, Tony you're the Montana, customs officer, listen to and Mr. you don't Corleone. have any ex and, and the only and and the only, only explanation you have for someone no, paying fifteen thousand dollars is, is he imposter. should only pay fifteen thousand. Yes, that's that's you guys are pay, Mr. Flores, and you, you get you, you guys are worthless uh, uh, Mr. Mr. Corleone said your package is worth uh, five million or something. So. Fifteen thousand is nothing, Mr. Flores. Once you get your price, only just if you deal. Look, we have to take up business before before the bank closes, Mr. Flores. It's Friday. There will be there will be. Today, you guys will be getting no need deposit to take care today. Of it today Mr. You Flores. scammers, you scammers won't be scamming him today. So you guys need to Mr. think of other day, okay? He's not going to be getting any hey, scam Corleone, today. Corleone, I'm going to try to call him up, okay? I don't, I don't know if he's on the line or not. Mr. Flores. Yeah, Mr. Flores. Keep... This is Corleone. This is Corleone, Mr. Flores. Uh, hey, gone? man. Who are you? Who, why are you calling Mr. Flores? I told you to stop calling Mr. Flores. I don't know you, and I don't know a shit you're I'm talking Jack about. Sparrow, what are you man. talking about? I never... I'm, who are you? I don't know, know any Jack Sparrow. Sparrow. You are yeah, a who scammer. Are you? Who are you? And we're going to get rid of you guys. We soon, we're we we're just this close to getting a confirm well, on your location. Well, man. You That's can do all. whatever you want. Look, I, I know you. I know you're in Jamaica. Look, Mr. Colone. Colone. Yes. Colone. Look, who are these guys? Are these the same guys from the other day trying to get in our business? Who? Yeah. Which guys are you talking about? Inform yeah. me. Which you. guy? My name is you. James Cooper. You pot right, guy. Right. You, My you name not, is James. That's Steven. That's Steven. That's the Look, Steven from Mr. yesterday. Flores, Mr. Flores is our customer now. So just get off the line. Let us work. Now, okay? now listen. Listen. You guys yeah, are incriminated. That's all I could let you know. Really? You guys have been uh, failing to complete your job for the past really? few days, really? and we'll what you're you going to do right really? now is we, we get you guys arrested. We already we'll got eight thousand dollars. Now he's ready we'll, to we'll pay see who's winning this game. So okay, you you, you are you, you are just delaying it. Okay, just get off, get off. Don't call him. What anymore. are you guys I'm talking not? about? I my Look, name is James from Maryland. Who you are? Get off the line. I already lost it. Now you can't tell me anything. I'm just going to give you guys an advice. You guys will be receiving... You guys won't be receiving $15,000. You guys, you guys won't be receiving $15,000 or any sort of payment, okay? Now, all I need you guys to know... Shut up. Mr. Flores, 
Corleone, it's okay. Yes. I got control of his phone again. You got it. I already got him. You got it. Yeah, I got control. So okay. I, I can we already it. compromised it. Mr. Flores' I'm phone. Leaving. We already I'm compromised. Uh, send a, this guy. That's a lie, I can Corleone. Send this I've guy. got control of it. He doesn't I, give up. He doesn't give phone. up this guy, man. I can't send this guy anymore. Okay, Let, let's work it out together. Okay? All right, I'll call I, you, I, call I'll call you on your line. All right. Call me back. I stand up. Okay. Hi. Eileen. Yes. Eileen, are you there too? I'm here. Oh, my friend Eileen is there, Pocho. Remember Who's the there? one that uh, scared you? <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> Hello. That's my, the one that wanted that's chocolate my Russian cake. friend. That's my yeah. Russian friend. <laughs> hey, by the way, she, I like she, chocolate, okay? She, she, wants, I really she do. wants to have chocolate cake with you. Remember? I know. That's, uh, I like chocolate, too. <laughs> with whipped cream? <laughs> Yes, please. Do you like to watch? <laughs> we like to watch the top. No, no, no. Oh, my God. These are <laughs> the same know. guys, Eileen. They said, we, like, I don't know how many days now. This guy doesn't so give now, up, man. Doesn't give up. No, they don't give up. Well, they're <laughs> hungry because now, now Mr. Flo is paying up $15,000. 15000 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's getting a bit of jealous because we're gonna get a fifteen thousand dollars check. And Tony Montana came came in the game now. <laughs> yeah. He is Tony the customs Tony officer. Tony Montana, Corleone. Yeah, Tony Montana. <laughs> For customs, U.S. customs. Jack Sparrow. I mean, what are the names that he come up with? Yeah. <laughs> you guys are doing a great job. Oh my God! There's so much fun. Yeah, it is. It is. It's incredible. So, how long have you been talking to James Cooper? Oh, he actually well, no, it's the James same Cooper number is from only today. Other Yesterday was but, uh, Stephen, like, Stephen something. Okay. Yeah, when I, but when I called us, when I called us, uh, Tony Montana, yeah. somebody else came in and said, "I, I am Corleone," because they they think I, I can only trust Corleone, right? <laughs> Mr. Flores only trusts Corleone. So he goes, I am Mr. Corleone. Don't trust that uh, Tony Montana. Trust Mr. Cooper. <laughs> and then and then Corleone calls, the real Corleone. And says, no, don't trust anybody. Just trust Tony Montana. Yeah, it's incredible. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm glad you guys are having a good time with them. Oh, we have. Well, by the way, uh, he also drives a truck, so we have nothing better to do. You know? <laughs> I know. We drive it for a long time, you know, for a long term. Yeah. We don't have nothing to do. Stop. That's Mr. Corleone. Mr. Vito to you. Yeah, Mr. Vito. Well, who, yeah. who would you be more most afraid of, uh, Eileen? Vito Corleone or Tony Montana? Who scares oh, you the most? I don't know. Huh? Both, both hot-blooded. Uh, see, that's, I don't that's know. A that's a tough one. That's, that's, that's tough. <laughs> my next, my next uh, um, nickname. Uh, they're calling. I'm gonna pick up. I'm gonna pick up. Just, you wanna come in as anything, Ali? No, I just want come to watch. A, oh, I mean, listen. Customs, come in as a customs officer. Somebody, another customs officer. Okay. <laughs> You're working with Colione. Okay. All right. Make up a name. Okay. Hello. Yes, I'm here. Hello. Yes. Yes, I'm here. You, Mr. Colione? Yes, this is Mr. Carleone. Okay, well, I'm talking to the a different customs officer. Uh, somebody else taking What's charge of my customs money. Customs, money. customs officer, his name. Mr. Corleone? Yes, this is Deputy Inspector Ulick. Yeah, yeah, Mrs. Ulick. Uh, so, uh, Mr. Tony Montana is not work, no longer on my case? No, he's not. No, no, he, he's... He, no Mr. Montana, okay. he's he's on va He had to take a leave of absence. Okay, so, no. Mr. Corleone, so Eileen, then, the one I need to deal with? I already sent you the information, Mr. Corleone. Just do the deposit in the Chase Bank. Uh, the Doris Felix, and just turn off your phone. I already texted you the information. Write it down and turn off your phone, all right? Am uh, I speaking with Mr. Corleone? Yes, this is Mr. Corleone. Yes, well, we have a we we will have an issue with this deposit. Uh, it does have to clear customs. It may take forty eight hours. I know, I know. That's why we that's why we want him to go ahead and make a deposit right now, so he has enough time. Okay. Yes, but it's already Friday afternoon, and everything is closed. No, the bank is still open. I just checked. The bank is still open. Okay, well, that so, must uh, that must be the drive up. Yeah. What? Mr. Sparrow sent yeah, me the good. bank account, so just go to that, deposit it to no. that account. The Chase bank account that I send you, Doris, your phone, look on, the, look on your phone again, it's Doris. Sparrow. To the Chase but, but account. Mr. Sparrow 
send me a, a Wells Fargo account. Miss, the person that is that information is impersonating Mr. Sparrow, okay? We don't want what? you to lose your money today, all right? The person is impersonating Mr. Sparrow, all right? It's a chase information. It's on your phone. So Doris... Uh, Mr. Colione. I don't know. It, it, my, my messages keep being deleted. I don't... I, the only one I've got is Mr. Sparrow's message. Mr. Corleone. All right, I'm going to... Hello, pay attention yes, to me. This is Deputy Inspector Ulex. So the information we have here is for the deposit to be made to Doris Felix. Yes, is, in the is Chase, that correct? In the Chase account. Yes, Matt, that's correct. In the Chase no, account. But Mr., but we Mr. need her Sparrow contact information. Why you need her contact information? Because the form is incomplete, but now that I'm looking on page two, I see that we have it. My apologies, sir. Okay, no problem. All right, so, Mr. Car Mr. Flores, I'm going to text you the information yes. again, and tell me, tell me when you receive it, okay? But, uh, but my phone is just messing up again. I don't All right, get a, get, a pen, get a pen and a paper. Get a pen and a paper. I'm going to give you the information, then you write it down, okay? Okay, but the lady from customs is telling me, yes. what am I supposed to do? Yes. I, I'm getting confused here. Okay, she's, she's working with us, okay? Everything is fine, all right? So, Mrs. Ulick, you're working with Mr. Corleone? Yes, so I'm going to give you the information because we cannot no, afford sir. anything to go wrong now. No, sir, I'm not working. We're, this department is not working with this person. What? No, sir, this is something new. I don't, I've never spoken to Mr. Corleone before in my life. What? Did he what? tell... Did he tell you to make what, a deposit? Uh, what, 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 can, can you get Mr. Uh, what's his name? Mr. Montana, he knew my case. Did he know my case? Mr. Montana is already on my case. Uh, right, but as I said, I have my package uh, as I said before, today, sir, by tonight. Mr. Montana has Mr. taken Montana a leave. My, can you, he's taken well, a leave of absence. Or something because he said he was working with Corleone and, and he could have my money clear today by tonight. But we are we are here telling you now that the customs officer is on the line and I'm going to give you the information for you to make a deposit. But okay, okay, so write okay, it down. I'll write it down. Okay, it's Doris. Believe. Doris. I'm going to spell it. Okay? D O R. I F. Is that okay. Boris or Doris? Yes, Doris. Doris. Bor Elise. Boris. Doris. That's D as in dog, O as in orange, R as in race, I as in Indian, and F as in Sam. Yes, sir, but <clears throat> this is uh, this is Deputy Inspector Ulick. I don't see that information in our customer base, a Doris Philly. Well, your information must be wrong on your computer. Check it again. Well, I'm looking right at it. We have had a rash of these people. Affectionately, we call them scammers, and they try to get a well, lot of people to make that's deposits. That's what Mr. Sparrow says. Mr. Sparrow says everybody else is a scammer. Yes, we've had a rash of them, and you're not to deposit uh, any money with people you don't know. These people, okay. they're, they're yeah, scammers, and, and they'll lie you and are, cheat. Mr. Flores, yeah. you, you need to listen to me sir mr carleone you know i will never do anything to mess you up all right remember we're supposed to eat in pizza and drink coke so that's why i, I want another to call. hello hi mr flores how can i help you how are you yeah uh, i hear uh, mr uh, montana is not longer working with his uh, ali or something okay. is that true okay yes is that true that's true yes that's true okay so, That's true. So, okay, okay. Yes, we got some okay, inconvenience so, right now, but everything uh -huh. she says is going to be true, okay? So, work so with listen Mr. Her. Yes, okay. listen to her, please. Listen to her. Don't listen to nobody else, okay? Why, why, why aren't you picking up? I, I've been calling you all afternoon. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mr. Flores. I got something going on. My... I just got my wife cheating on me, then I'm very upset right now. Then I really can't talk right now. Oh my I'm very God. upset. Yeah, I'm very, very upset right now. Then I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but please, please. Got my, so got the, I should really talk to the agent. She's going to take care of you, okay? okay? Please, okay, okay. listen okay. Thank you. Don't listen to nobody Thank else. You. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. I'll call okay. you as soon as I can. Bye-bye. Okay. Sir Flores. You like then. Her, yeah. her, who is this? Okay, you're still there? Yeah. Okay, all right. Um, The agent gave me the information to give to you, the lady, because she said that... Um, uh, she had to run back in a meeting. So take Mr. It to Flores, you, he's lying to yeah. you. I'm not in a meeting. I'll be happy to talk to you. Do not, uh, under any circumstances, deposit any money yeah. into Chase. No, sir. No? No. These people will be having your account number, your routing number, and they'll, they'll drain your bank account dry. What? They are scammers. They steal. They lie. 
and they cheat. Now you sound like a what? very nice gentleman. Don't get taken in yeah. by this Mr. Corleone kind of guy. He is he is okay. lying to you. Okay, so what what do I have to do now for you for, to get my package released today? Is there still time or, or not any? No, there's no more time. No, there's nothing you have to do because you won't be receiving any package when you make this deposit. I'm sorry to have to tell you that. Do you understand? Mr. Flores? Yes. What you need to do is to get, we can clear this situation up without any problem. All you need to do is to get a vanilla card. Uh -huh. you, you can get several of them totaling $15,000 and I can make sure that you get what you deserve. Do you understand? And so that'll be deposited to the account that Jack gave me. Mr. Sparrow? Yes, Mr. Sparrow. It'll go right okay. into the Wells Fargo account. Okay. So I'm going to try to go to the bank right now then and, and see, see if I can get it done today. Wonderful. 4 though. I think you'll still have time. Okay. Okay, I'm not leave right now. I'm gonna leave and, and I'm gonna call Mr. Corleone, okay? Okay. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you, sir. You're welcome. Bye -bye. My pleasure. Hello? Hello. Hello. Hi. Oh, they're calling me. They're calling <laughs> me like crazy. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't, oh my God. I didn't get yeah, the well, gist of what was going on, so I'm sorry if I messed no, things yeah, up. That's right. No, no, <laughs> they're, still, they're still believing that, I mean, since, since um, Tony Montana is out, uh, he just came in as a new as a new associate. associate? Maybe, maybe your Corleone's <laughs> wife or something. They're calling me nonstop. Let me call that phone. Hello? Hello. Hi, uh, Eileen is there too. So yeah, I so Eileen, you you are a scammer too, okay? So you you're working with Corleone and Jack Sparrow. Okay. So I'll pick up their call once they call again. But remember, you already make the deposit, okay? Yes, yes, yes Mr. Corleone. Corleone told me to call you. Who? Hello, hello. Corleone, you hearing me? Yes, yes, I, I'm talking to Mr. Yeah. Corleone. Yes. I'm taking the necessary information over because you're what? getting too much, all right? What? I can't hear you. We're gonna be taking over the information that you have got there that Mr. Um, Mr. Call you only just gave to you. Well, I'm talking to uh, Officer Eileen now. Mr. Corleone talked talk to me, Officer Eileen. She's on the line right Back? now. She's on the line, but yes. she's yes. calling you a lot. She's what? telling you a lot. No, no, no. I don't it's think that's... Take you, to my you know that's not true. Austin, she... This is Officer she's Eileen. She's just a bit. What? Just a bit. That a whore. Every guy's fuck. What? I'm saying that lady is just a bitch that every guy's fuck. Oh my God, Mr. Corleone. Listen to me carefully. You need to listen, all right? You just what? need to listen carefully because guys are just some balonies, all right? Who? That lady, she's a bitch. Nothing but a bitch. She's just trying to pretend. Now, why would you say what that? What, what, what about Officer Cooper? <laughs> oh, Officer yeah. Cooper Man, okay. or, or Montana? I, I just remember to the my package. package. <laughs> what do I have to do to receive my package? Can you please tell me? Just I want to call Mr. Mr. Corleone. Mr. Flores. I don't you, need Mr. you. Corleone. You need to get those vanilla cards remember, for me. The, says, the Bible says, oh, be unto woman, okay? Don't pay That's attention what they to use. that guy. Don't, he's lying okay, to you. You're never going to see anything from from him she's trying to pretty okay she's too good to be true i have better shoes than you do so good to be true she's a very great defender all right no mr flores woman, don't okay? work with this guy he's scamming you got his hair because of a woman okay hello mr flores i'll tell you what yes. though you get me those vanilla gift cards and i'll let you lick my boots She's just another bitch trying to rip you off, all right? Uh, I, I want Are to you talk to Mr. Corleone. I don't know what's going on now. Mr. Corleone cannot control this anymore, okay? This is it out of the hand of Mr. Corleone. I can't no, let you know that. Me right? work with... He told me the package is in customs. See, he's the only what one I'm trying, to... trying to help me just, out. He's Everybody just trying to be good book yeah. tell you that old woman, okay? What? Mr. Flores, this I'm going to send you a second package, too, to sweeten he's the gonna deal. He's going to send you a package, you a package when you only have one one package here. No, I'm um, going to send him one. something special. Wait, I'm uh, getting another what? call. I'm picking up another call. He's not getting right. for you. Somebody's calling. Hello? He's just another bitch. Okay. Hello, Hello, Mr. Flores. You don't know what Mr. you're Corleone. talking about. Yes, what, yes, Mr. Flores. Listen, listen. All the other ones in this calls, and I don't know what's going on. What? Don't let I that lady you. deal, okay? I haven't called you at all. Wait. Who's calling you? Mr. Montana. What's wrong with you? Can't you see she's just a bitch? Who are you? How dare listen, you talk to me like that? Listen, I'm the general assistant here, and you need to listen. I'm Mr. Corleone. Okay. Bitch. 
trying to, to get Cor- something. I don't know who's this guy. I don't know why he's trying to make it up. I really don't know. Who are you anyway? I'm the general assistant here for everything. Nothing can be delivered without me. He's All a right? scammer. I'm the I'm customs the inspector. I'm the one that takes over everything in control right now. I'm in control. All right. You don't know I'm anything. Trying to create something like there, someone, but I can guarantee you. I Let me have your you badge ID. Business. Let me have your badge ID. Listen, I, you do business with them, and you're going to see that. They're going to rip you off. You see that, lady? Let it's me have your badge. Bitch, okay? What's your badge number? I'm going to report MR5. you. What is it? MR5, you cannot report me. Our company is licensed by the Better Business Bureau and the life number. So I'm you're going just to trying to get you. into... I'm going to report you to the FBI. Boy, as you can see, the way he talks... Better you Business the Bureau and the life... You're not in but a bit. You see the vocabulary he's using with the woman? Go ahead and report me. Really? Oh, my God. My he's business a fake. is licensed by the Better Business Bureau. He's a you fake. Can go on the website. There's not, the no fire. such thing as... That. Don't listen, that scam. He's yes, impossible. Mr. Floyd, don't listen. Oh, Start. Don't listen to that scam. Another bitch. Not. Okay. Hello. Can you look like that, sir? No such thing. Badge number. You don't need a badge number. Are there are FBI? We are not any FBI's. Okay. We work with the Internal Revenue Department Service, and our oh business is licensed by the Business Bureau of. Oh. Of chamber. Give me your address. Give me your address. Okay, Give, me your building building address. Give me your building address right away, so I can believe I'm you. Sorry? Give me your address number right now. That's Who's 141. That's 141. Well, let me hear you. They have such Stop. a crappy California. phone. Oh my God! He says he's on, he was on Maryland. He's on California. California. Oh my God! I Mr. told Florida, you he was you fake. See. I told you. No, you can't. Hear he's Mr. a bitch. Do you see he's the, the one that's the Flores. Are you listening to him the way he talks to a woman? Disgraced person. I'm listening. To you are a disgraced person. The way you talk. Shame on you. Shame on you, the way you talk to a woman. Can you believe Shame the way you. his mother raised him? It's not because he came from a woman. That's the reason why. Women are the deceiver in our life, okay? Woman God. is a deceiver. Oh, I've never read the fact he, he still, he's still talking. He's still talking. This guy sounds like a real bomba class. He's shame on you. Yes. You got a big problem, man. <laughs> you really got a big you problem. <laughs> eh? You came out of the woman. Remember, you came out of the woman. Yes, and that's the same way. woman. Uh, remember, okay, remember. Look at you. I disgrace you. Okay, remember. I disgrace you. Should apologize. Remember. You should apologize. Remember. Do you hear Mr. Flores? Sir. Do you hear him? Do you think he's a, remember, he's a true person? Take one of our case and make a woman, all right? I remember, one of our from the woman. I can't believe it. Can't Without us, there would be any female. I'm listening. Listen, Mr. Flores. I'm going to be quiet. Just listen to him, okay? Listen, okay? Talk. Talk. Remember, our rib cage, cage um, we take one of our ribs and make woman, okay? We are the ruler of the herd. Don't let any woman try to rule you. Any female at all, all right? We are the dominant person in the house. Mr. Flores, you are you there? How disgraced is this guy? How I want to let you know that we shame are the dominant you, person. Shame your mother. You didn't teach you well. You didn't teach you manners. Uh, shame you, mother. Well. Shame you. I can't believe it. Mr. Flores, you hear that? How, how can you trust a person like that? How can you trust a scammer like that? Let's see what happens in part three. Stay tuned for more Edwin, Vito Corleone, and Mistress Scambake.